Have you ever played a video game where you killed someone and gone, yeah, it's really cool that you dropped like three gold coins or whatever, but what would be really cool would be if you were to drop your kidneys. And I could take those kidneys and put them in my body instead of my kidneys. Welcome to Rod Flesh. Oh yeah, um, spoilers by the way. I'm gonna be talking about the whole game. You should still play it, but just so you know, okay? So why would you want someone else's kidneys, I hear you ask? Apart from the fact that you're a sick little freak. Well, turns out every organ has their own stats. You wanna be able to eat faster? Just get better intestines. You wanna get more life? Just get fatter. And if you wanna be able to heal your wounds, just get a better heart. Well, let's see. Would you... Can I just steal this guy's heart? Huh, I guess so. It really is that simple. You just kill someone and swap it out. I'm not joking either. That's the entire game. And it rocks. <laughs> God, God. Now I know, allegedly God made you in his image, right? But just hear me out on this one. What if his image wasn't good enough? What if his image should have had six lungs? Who am I to tell him he's wrong? You can totally have six lungs, by the way. Man, I don't really need intestines, do I? What I do need is speed. Oh, well, hold on, hold. Are you telling me lungs increase speed? And they stack, right? All right, so stealing organs out of enemy bandits. All right, yeah, we covered that. What's next? Stealing organs out of literal animals. What, you thought we were done? Hold on, can I steal animal? Huh. Now that's an intriguing stat. <gasps> so why are you even here? For reason one, organs. Reason two, you gotta kill this guy. Who are they? This is the what if I told you they had a really good heart? Without too much explanation, you're kind of just dropped in. All you know is you must seek out and kill Lene. Lene. Lene? Len well, luckily, you don't have to go out it alone. There's a whole town of people- She leads you to her yurt, where you quickly have sex before she has to go back to work. Huh. You slept with- But a bunch of quests and a drug trip later, they finally let you escape this goddamn desert hellhole into- Oh my f God! <sighs> I'm just gonna check. I'm just gonna check if if it's okay. Worm long. Well, it looks like desert vacation is finally over, and instead we're treated to this lush, serene, calming, quiet, peaceful, imperturbable greenery where no fighting at all is gonna take place. That's a fuck. Jesus Christ. Yeah, so I f lied. What are you gonna do about it? That's a message you do not want to see in real life. Organ decayed. Heart. Deep, deep in this coniferous oasis is the key to your quest, however. Despite the never-ending onslaught of the baddest mofos in the galaxy being around, people still manage to live here. To thrive. And in the settlement of Neorata, you manage to find- She leads you to her bedroom where you have passionate sex. Afterwards, she reads you poetry she wrote. Huh. You slept with- I think that was over here. What the? Are you telling me my shotgun has a? T 
This game fucking rocks. They are real stingy though, smelling immediately that they could just put you to work in exchange for information about your target. Everything from switching on some radios, rescuing a cat, to literally transporting some guy's poisoned lung within your own body, almost succumbing to your own wounds, and then giving it to him and he doesn't even want it, is stuff that these people apparently deem equivalent to just telling you that, oh yeah, Lene, yeah I know her, she's practically my best friend, she's at the North Pole, it's behind this door. Sp what the hell is a spine cat? Why did no one tell me about it? What was your plan now? Were you just gonna leave us here? Are you happy with- is this done? Are you done here? I'm just gonna check. There's a cat lung. And then you're there. The North Pole. Closer than ever to your final fight. Closer than ever to truth. So here they are, the final fight. The reason you're even here to begin with. The final confrontation, the person that's been eluding you for the last few hours, finally an equal battle. Are you gonna eat that? I don't know about this 